The German contribution to capacity building in Africa has been very, very useful, and very, very productive, and it's something that it's helping to develop brains all over the region. It's something that must continue. And, and I, I think the structure that is being used uh, is very important. ZEF selects around 30 students per year for its graduate program. The main selection criteria are an excellent master's or equivalent degree, an excellent research proposal, a keen interest in interdisciplinary research and relevant work experience. Yes, because of course we want to give gifted young researchers every opportunity to develop their natural talents. And very often these opportunities do not exist in their native countries. For this reason alone, they're doing their PhDs at an institution of excellence. But somehow the culture at CEF, the nature of the dialogues conducted here and the practical orientation of the courses ensure that the large majority of students return to their countries and demonstrate tremendous commitment to their work or as we say, great dedication to development. Four out of five students from developing countries trained at ZEF have returned to their region of origin or have found jobs in international institutions. Many former doctoral candidates continue to cooperate with us. They have received their doctorates and now hold positions at universities and are our local partners on the spot. This is a great advantage. ZEF maintains an alumni network of development-oriented academics and policymakers who have been affiliated with ZEF. This network provides ZEF with an increasing number of colleagues in key positions, both in research and government institutions. This network offers various possibilities for graduates to participate in joint conferences and workshops and to benefit from interaction with staff, lecturers and doctoral students from other international centers of science and research. Since its foundation in 1999, more than 400 young scientists from 77 countries have participated in the Bonn Interdisciplinary Graduate School for Development Research. The program has become internationally renowned and leading researchers from all over the world conduct research at ZEF and also teach at the Bonn Graduate School. I really find it extremely inspiring to teach here. They're really motivated, they're really eager to learn about development and environment issues that I teach about. And um, what I really like is that many of them really end up going back to their own countries, working there, applying the knowledge that they have learned here, and really making a difference. And some of them actually uh, very quickly are snapped up by UN organizations, international organizations, that of course also recognize that, that people that they would like to have in their organizations are people that, that, that can think laterally, that can communicate laterally, that can talk to other people in the organizations. And I think our students have proven to be very good at that. Uh, today, with the 10th anniversary of, of ZEF, it would be a good day to honor the author of the best thesis. Dr. Bob Yanov has studied agricultural commons in his home country, Uzbekistan. The University of Bonn is very proud that it has this center and that it has developed so successfully over the last 10 years. A further aspect of which we are also proud is that we are giving several faculties of the university, the Faculty of Agriculture, the Faculty of Philosophy and the Science Faculties, an opportunity to provide their specific input, thus making this a truly interdisciplinary program. We also are very demanding of our students. It's not, uh, you know, the, the, the interdisciplinary component of our program is something that the students have to accomplish on top of their normal program, it's getting a PhD. And so it's not something for the weak uh, brothers and sisters amongst us. That they have to be motivated, they have to be quite good. ZEF provides intense study supervision and tutoring and offers an all-round service to ensure that students, especially those coming from developing countries, can quickly settle into their studies and everyday life in Bonn. The services range from helping to find a place to live through support for visa application to preparations for the field research. Ten years of survey among the alumni show that the Bonn Interdisciplinary Graduate School for Development Research is achieving its main goal, that of educating future decision makers from developing countries as well as international scientists for a development-oriented career. I think you will have a bright future. Thank you.